Hello everyone. Thank you for joining us today for EDC's annual public meeting. This meeting is an opportunity to reflect on the achievements and lessons of the past year and to share more about where we want to take EDC. In 2023, we continued to support Canadian exporters, innovators and investors on the global stage. Our customers demonstrated exceptional resilience this year in the face of challenges flowing from ongoing wars and shifting market dynamics. We know it can be incredibly difficult to focus on long-term plans when each day seems to present new hurdles. But that is why we are here, why we are focused on accelerating the success of our customers. A central pillar of our 2030 strategy is to grow our support for Canada's medium-sized companies. And we served more than 1,200 with financial solutions in 2023. We also continued to lead with strong ESG principles. This led us to facilitate a record 12.2 billion in clean tech support, 8.9 billion of which was focused on renewable energy. We led the foundations of our sustainable finance portfolio through the launch of a new sustainable finance framework. And we are continuing to ensure Canadian business owners no matter their colour, religion, sexuality or background, have equal opportunity to achieve their international goals. To ensure we are meeting these exporters where they want to go, we bolstered our presence in the Indo-Pacific region. We opened representations in Seoul and Jakarta and added staff across the region, including at our standalone Singapore branch. With three more representations opening by the end of 2024, we continue to grow our footprint in the region, meeting exporters where we see the strongest potential for growth. Our contribution to the Canadian economy relies on the hard work of companies. Last year, our economics team, together with Statistics Canada, set out to understand and quantify the value we provide to our customers. This seminal study found that Canadian exporters who have received EDC support generated 22% more revenue had 15% higher employment and 5% greater employee productivity than similar exporters who were not EDC customers. I want to extend my heartfelt gratitude to our customers and partners. You are our raison d'etre and your success is our export impact. And to our dedicated employees, it is thanks to your efforts that 2023 was a year in which our customers were, again, able to grow and succeed. This sets an amazing foundation to support even more Canadian ambition and growth in 2024, EDC's 80th anniversary. As we mark this important milestone, I'm struck by the breadth of opportunities before Canada. Our natural resources and clean technologies will play a key role in the global energy transition. New commercial partnerships and trade agreements will give exporters more reasons to diversify markets. And our agri-food sector will play a critical role in feeding the world. In the pages of our 2023 Integrated Annual Report, you'll find more details about the achievements and opportunities I've just mentioned, and much more. Thank you.